Okay, now let's take a look at question 2. Study the circuit diagram below. The diagram includes four bulbs A, B, C and D and one battery in the middle. Okay, they are arranged in a parallel position, the bulbs. Okay, now the question is, which bulb if faulty would allow only one other bulb to light up in the circuit? Okay, let's take a look at each of the bulbs one at a time. Let's take a look at the first one. And let's make notes here. Okay, so what will happen if bulb A is faulty? Okay, if bulb A is faulty, the electric current will still be able to pass through B and C and also D as well. So actually, all other three bulbs will light up. So bulbs B, C and D will still light up. Okay, then let's go on to the next one. What happens if bulb B is faulty? If bulb B is faulty, let's take a look here. Okay, if bulb B is faulty, the current will still be able to pass through A and C as well as D. Okay, without being interrupted. So again, all the other three bulbs will light up. Box A, C, and D will light up. Okay, what happens if box C is faulty? So if box C is faulty, let's take a look at the diagram. If C is faulty, okay, the current will still be able to pass through D. But, okay, when the current is passing through B, it will not be a closed circuit anymore. The same goes for A. If the current passes through A, okay, it will not be able to pass through C anymore. So only bulb D will light up. Okay? So if bulb C is faulty, bulbs A and B will not light up. Okay, only bulb D will light up. Okay, let's take a look at the last one. What happens if bulb D is faulty? Okay, since bulb D is right at the bottom of the circuit, okay, if bulb D is faulty, it will not affect any of the other bulbs. Okay, current will be still be able to pass through from the top of the circuit. So if bulb D is faulty, bulbs A, B and C will be able to light up. Okay, now, if we look at the notes we have written, okay, which one would allow only one other bulb to light up in the circuit? Okay, if we look at this option here, only bulb C. If bulb C is faulty, okay, bulbs A and B will not light up. Only one other bulb will light up, which is bulb D. So, answer is C.